Hello everybody, Sift here again with another Backpack Hero Run and today we got a new patch. Now, this patch doesn't have that many things but it has a couple of things that changed. The main thing that they added is this thing, the Brass Knuckle, the weapon we're gonna start today. This thing is an accessory actually, not even a weapon and what it does is it adds one damage to scratch and also another two damage on top of that based on how many rings you have. So we're gonna try to pick up as many lucky rings as possible. Uh, we're gonna go with a classic opening with sword and shield, broad and sword, and they also changed how the energy looks like. In my opinion, good choice, because, you know, both were yellow. What is even happening? This is completely new. Exit to the crypt and exit to the bramble. Let's go to the bramble. What does that even mean? A new area? Who knows? Let's hope it's not gonna be hard, because... Ooh, we got a new area! I didn't even know! Double Hermit Crab. Ten life opponents. Wait, what? Each turn adds 6 blocks to enemy. Each combat adds 25. Okay, so they don't die first combat. Oh, and the shield sound, like when you tick this, like, clink, clink. I'm not sure if you guys listen to hear it. Let me actually uh, increase it a bit for a moment. Do you hear, like, you hear this? It, it, it might be a bit uh, loud right now, but... Um, first of all, let's kill the 6 damage guy. Like, oh, 1, 2, and I would say 3. We take 6. It's better than shielding for 7. Uh, I want to I want to make the sound effect here. Give me a second. L listen to this. Ting ting, you know. Nice. I love it. I love it. Let's reduce the sound of where it was. Maybe about here, just so we have a couple more sound effects. I mean, I'm hearing them, but I'm not sure if the recording is, if they're audible. And, uh, yeah. Okay, first enemies found. Already harder than the mouse. The mice. And they changed also what the mana stone looks like. And they also added an icon to conductive. Now it's a little electricity bolt. And this should also have it. Nice. So you can very quickly see what is conductive and what not just by floating over them. Pick up the money. I would say let's even pick up the energy. And if anything, let's make it even more better like this. Uh, we got a Tetris piece over here on energy. And uh, yeah, let's go. Just because the energy changed <laughs> uh, what it looks like doesn't mean anything. I need to find rings in general. I'm chasing rings, 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 rings. And in case I didn't already mention it, I'm chasing rings. <laughs> that was a joke this this last time. And this last thing I said. Experience is at 10, so we're about to level up again. Let's go with the classic opening. Okay, I don't see any ring yet. I'm a bit disappointed. I found my healing, I found more energy, I found a bunch of things. I also found a also found a nunchuck, which does a lot of damage. I don't think I need a nunchuck yet. Is there a key though? There is no key. There is an event. I don't know what the event oh, Radwolf and Hermit Crab. Think think. Hello. <laughs> Anybody there? We're obviously gonna block whatever this thing is doing. And now we can assassinate this thing. Uh, yeah, might as well. And uh, go for another energy and a shield, I guess, twice. Could have just gone for the shield consumable. I should have also gone for the region. Let's go for the region. I can keep this guy at bay anyway. Uh, I just need to protect us for one turn at the most anyway. Here you go. And now he doesn't have shielding and that should be that. And I'm full life too. Nice. And I found my first ring. Boom. And now this thing gives us 3 damage to the Scratch. Now, the Scratch right now does 3 default plus 3, 6. The moment I get one more ring, the Wooden Sword is out and the run officially begins. And our Jason Weapon is used heal 1. I mean, that's pretty useless. Uh, let's go here. Do I need a key? I need a key, yes. Let's get a key. Do I need two keys? I need two keys, yes. Let's uh, throw away the 12 damage, honestly. Uh, I can go with the Liquid Armor. It's a bit more universally useful. I can take other items, right? Yeah, no, because I have the ring. Off to key 1. Oh, that, that's not a key. I mean, imagine I throw the potion on it and somehow the, the lock becomes more powerful. Oh, give me a second because I have a couple of sound effects uh, blasting around in my house. Okay, I'm back. Uh, not sure if the sound effects were even audible, but you know, for safety sake, just to not pollute you. Oh, and as you see, there, there, there seems to be like some kind of bug where things are off screen when they, when they launch, but it doesn't really matter. Like those are irrelevant errors. Let's throw this away and put this in as this is the same damage, but also applies weak. Might as well pick up the consumables. Off to the next fight, not actually an event. What is this? Pro Rabbit. Each combat adds one dodge to enemy. So this thing is a against dodge enemy and... Wait, what? 13 damage incoming? How am I supposed to shield and smack him at the same time? When he has a dodge. You know what, for one turn I'm gonna let it slide, slide but let's see if on the second turn we're gonna have the same problem. Okay, he's a healer. Okay, okay, I get it. This way I do understand how you can damage him, obviously, right? One... Oh, at each combat he gains a shield. Okay, okay, I take back what I said. Not really that hard of an enemy. 
He's a healer plus he has some shielding. I, I like him, I like him, I like him. I like the new easy enemy over here. Uh, we found, is this a ring? This is a ring and an accessory. When diagonal shield is used, it gets blocked and it's also rare. The fact that we got a rare thing, this is energy. Um, okay, I mean, we're definitely, definitely, definitely gonna take the ring. And now the shield is even better, obviously. So now we got two rings. So at this point, I do 5 plus 3, 8 damage with the brass knuckles. Uh, I still believe I should go for the club for now. Uh, depends on the opponent, depends on the opponent. Let's get the shield and I would say let's go. I could also throw away both frothy ring and shield and go for the super energy. Let's go for this. Let's go for this. I don't know what the, the final boss is going to be. And no matter how you slice it, this is going to be better. Maybe a new event? Not a new event. <laughs> I want this. Please, 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 dear gods of luck. Yes! That's how luck works, man. And now we're going to go two out of two. I control my luck by requesting the glove again. No, we didn't get it. But at least my luck worked once. I have eight more coins. Let's go another one. One more last time. We're going to also pick up a curse. Or are we going to pick up the thing I want? No, we're going to pick up the pavis, which is really good. Honestly, pavis is good. So we're going to throw away food. We're going to obviously take this as we are a scratch build. So now my scratch does um, seven, eight damage plus two. Eight plus two. Now it does 10 damage and two of those are also spread. So we're going to throw this away. I no longer need anything else. I will use my scratch. As I said, five. Wait. Yeah, as I said, 5 plus 3 base damage. Actually, 5 plus 2 is 7 plus 3 base damage is 10. So it's definitely more than 7. So it's good enough for me. I can still keep the energy. And now I can use the Pavis to shield. Uh, this thing says that it provides more block to both shields. So we're going to go like this. Now when I use this, both of these will get buffed. When a diagonal shield is used. Ah, only diagonal. Okay. I'm sorry for the mistake. So Pavis goes here. Pretty much the only force diagonal we have. Yep, and this way, now both of these give us more shield than what they should. Very nice. The, the fact that we got, like, Pavis this early. Pretty mediocre everything. Oh, you can go back to events! You can go back to events? Please tell me you can also go back to shops, and I'm in love. Man, if they make it so, if they made it so that you can go to repeatable events more than one time... I love them. They, inc they inc improve the game day after day, man. Day after day, the game becomes better. 11 shield, not enough. Let's go one more now. The scratch should do 8. Plus 2 should be 10 damage. Yeah, exactly. I do 10 damage per scratch now. Maybe I overshield a bit. Let's go. Boom, boom, dead. Nice, 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 nice. The build starts uh, setting up, uh, I guess, coming together. Uh, I mean, we're definitely gonna take the other shield, obviously, because we do have a Pavis here, so this is like a mega shield per press, and this is a ring accessory. So, adjacent magical found protection with this ring. Yeah, okay, it's a, it's the it's the magic gives you armor thing. But for now, we're gonna take it for damage, obviously. Obviously, we're gonna take it for damage, and uh, later we're gonna see what we're gonna go do with it. Maybe we're gonna find better rings. I haven't found a lucky ring yet, which is obviously pretty unlucky. Okay, we're fighting pretty easy opponents here. 19 armor in one turn. Wow, insane. Just just insane. Scratch, scratch. I love it. I love it. I love it. If I find two more glove of knives and like one brass knuckle, I'm um I'm a heavy camper. I'm a heavy camper. Although I obviously I'm obviously requesting for a lot of things here. I do realize that those are not rare items, uh, often items to get. But um yeah, maybe I'm lucky, man. Maybe I'm lucky. The more you request, the more you receive. Let's go over here, see what we get. I have myself, I don't have enough gold, I'm stupid. But, 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 the new events supposedly do not go away. Yes! I love you, game. I love you, game. Gabriel Ruffin involved. Isn't this what we fought previously? Nope, this is, this is a classic fight. Let's go one, two. Yeah, that's enough for sure. And scratch. Pass. I know I have a bunch of consumables that I don't use. But honestly speaking, if I don't need to use them... Uh, the only thing that they're going to actually provide is expedite the process of destroying the opponents, right? Which isn't even something I really care about. Let's shield once, and then we go scratch, scratch. And then next turn, I should be uh, doing enough damage to do just double, triple scratch and be done with this. I, I'm, I'm, I, In my opinion, scratch and organize should not be there. Oh, I found two more rings. Two more rings, this and this. Yeah, we're going to definitely take those. So I would say we throw away one of the consumables. It's the simplest solution. And uh, where can I put them? First of all, one can go for definitely here, and the other one can go definitely here for now. Now, obviously, we slowly start losing the space around all this. Uh, what I'm most likely going to do is have the Guardian Ring here in the bottom. Like, uh, actually, let's re reorganize right now to make it right now, so I don't have to deal with it later. We just pull everything down. 
like this. And everything stays the same pretty much. And this goes back, this goes back. Uh, this can go here and this goes here. And now I already have set up the room around this thing while also the shield is buffing everything because a diagonal is this. Like this is diagonal, this is diagonal, and this up here is diagonal. I obviously need a better shield than this stupid thing. Uh, but for now, we're just gonna go on. Uh, I'm not gonna go events yet. I don't know which events are permanent and which events are um, use them or lose them. You know what? Let's go with shield and just spam scratches. I'm gonna go this the last attack. Nice. Shield, 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 exactly. And now we're gonna go scratch a one. Scratch a two uh, in the mega shield because I gain like a million mega shield. <laughs> because I'm gaining a million shield. Very nice. By the way, because I used the scratch build, that was a mistake. Uh, I will find healing. Because I used the scratch build, I can go with pacifism ring if I'm lucky enough. If I'm lucky enough. I would say here, and the last one, I guess here, and then we're gonna start doing lines. Yes, I found another one. Wow, I found literally the same one. Wow, this is a really good ring. I mean, it's not the best ring in the universe, don't get me wrong, but still, it's a very useful ring. Although only one can actually hit a, a bunch of things with a good, um, I guess, corner hit. The rest won't really do that much. Yeah, I, I don't see how I could possibly make these rings better, but for now we just have more rings. Let's go next fight, Rabbit. That should be an easy fight. Okay, let's go with regen and energy and pop this. And then we're gonna go shield first and then scratch, scratch. Nice. Okay, and uh, you know what? We're gonna just shield and pass. Oh, the regen even got like a sound effects like glum, glum, something like that. It's a bit, uh, it's a bit less noisy. Ooh, plus four damage, Ruby. I mean, obviously we don't need it, but it's a legendary, and we're gonna sell it. And we obviously got the Snatch, Snats, Slats shield. Uh, do I need a key? I don't really need a key, so let's just get random items to sell in the shop. Uh, well, first of all, we can definitely buy and sell this. So let's buy and sell this, and also might as well get a key. I, I got everything I can. Let's go to the shop. Hey shop, take this. Uh, and the other one, take this too. Wait, what is it saying? Drag to sell to me. Ja 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 drag to sell to me. Cannot afford? Cost 17. No way. No way. Oh, you give it to him exactly. I only buy one item. And now it's gonna cost me six to take it back? No, why? Why did the previous one say that I could not take it? Anyway, we're gonna definitely buy the like ring. Cost six. They changed the shop. So I've been told that there is a bug that you just go away from him and then go back to him and he accepts it. Yep. <laughs> I have to say, although right away, I want to say that I don't like this new system. I don't know. I, I don't like that this guy only accepts one one uh, one purchase per per go. And that's not a good idea in my opinion. What is this? No, no one. Because I'm okay. I don't care about that. Let's go event. Let's see what this is. Okay, get a different item of the same rarity. Yeah, this guy's still pretty trashy, I would say. Still pretty trashy. Uh, let's go to the healer. Uh, the shop only accepting one per sell is definitely a bad choice, in my opinion. Okay, so the moment you accept one of the trades she has to offer, she disappears. Good to know. But I still believe that it's a bad trade. The reason why it's a bad thing, um, you know, I just abused the, the bug, but still, the reason I think it's a bad thing to be selling, I, I guess they did it. I guess they did it because people were going there and finding like a legendary and they were like, okay, I'm going to just give him 10 off my items and just pick up the legendary, which is obviously awesome, right? It's awesome to be like, oh, what is this new enemy? Bandit Lord. Bandit Lord. Okay, what do you do? Each combat adds three dodge to enemy. Each combat. So he just starts with three dodge. Uh, we already know for a fact that dodge is one of those things that go down per turn, but it doesn't matter at the end of the day. Wait, why did my first attack... Okay, my first attack burned two of his dodges. That is because I have the scratch damage, which is, you know, this button, and then I also have the AoE damage. But for some reason, my second scratch did not do that. I don't know why. Boom. You see, I'm doing two attacks. Whenever I attack him, you see two numbers pop out. 33 healing. Okay. I mean... We just do damage. What can I say? Shield once. Scratch, scratch. Smack is back. And uh, I think I have lethal. 18 damage per pop. Yep, I have lethal. Bye-bye. Oh, we got energy. One of the best things we could have gotten. We literally. I don't know what else we could have gotten that would somehow affect this uh, this run. Okay, things off screen once again. 
Uh, let's go here. I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a block. It's, it blocks. It blocks. <laughs> it provides blocking. And uh, I don't think I need anything else. What is this? Remove enemy. Yeah, remove effects on enemies. Maybe if they create get spikes or whatnot. What is this? Swamp. Well, I don't want to go to swamp anyway. Uh, the swamp is filled with spikes and me doing away damage with the, you know, cleaver thingies. What are they called? The the scratches. It definitely is not a good idea. Let's go here. So this is 21 damage incoming. So we definitely block that. You see, did you see that this guy, did you see that he had one dodge and he took zero damage? And if I attack, for example, somebody else, yeah, like, it, it isn't worth it. I don't know. You're going to see, for example, oh, that was a mistake. That was a mistake on my part. But look at this. He has one dodge, right? I'm going to press this. Normally, it should scratch him and also damage him. But no, dodge blocks everything, it seems. So, um, yeah, obviously, I lost life because I was overzealous. Found the dodge whenever needed button. And I also found another shield to put in this line. So let's throw this away. Put another shield in this line. And uh, I might as well throw this away. Like, okay, energy is good and all. But it's nice sometimes to just go with I get a free dodge before dying, you know. And I found another ring that is not the spell ring. And let's throw the spell ring away. And let's pick... Uh... For now, let's not pick up the shield. I can find other shields. I can find other shields. But we will pick this up. We will pick up max life. I know I'm missing a bunch of life, but we're going to heal it up slowly and surely. Slowly and surely. Uh, did I throw something out? Not really. That's needed. What is this event? I mean, I could go to the event from here on out. We know that events no longer pose any danger. Let's also drink this. Throw this away. Now we go scratch it. Scratch it. Scratch it. Bye bye. I don't know why I'm like scratch it. I'm... I... Yeah, no idea. Literally no idea. I'm talking like that. And now this is almost ready. It provides 15 damage. Like, I, I really hope we find another Brass Knuckles, by the way. Like, if I find one more Brass Knuckles, this run is going to be a god run already. Ah, I tried to I tried to force it by, <laughs> by saying it. Let's get the Legendary. There is a shop on the map. Yep, let's get the Legendary. And uh, let's get pretty much whatever, honestly speaking. Ooh, Poison even showcases its symbol there. Vampirism symbol? There is no Vampirism symbol. But there is a Poison symbol. Yeah, nice. I like the fact that there is a poison symbol. I want to see it on a dagger. Uh, yeah, we're going to sell him the poison. I was going to be like, I'm not the only one item. Is this going to cost me 17 now? No. So there is seems to be a bug that... Uh, come on. I got my money. Ah, you know what they most likely did? They increased how much money you gain by selling. I think that's why they did. If they did that, then hats off to them. No joke. Like, um, yes, I'm, I'm accepting the double-triple selling as long as they did what I just mentioned, which is, uh, you know, let's smack, 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 smack and just dodge. Uh, as, as long as they made it so that you get so much more money out of every single time you sell something, then yes, I'm okay with it. Uh, obviously, we're going to abuse the fact that right now the selling system is broken. Right? I mean, that's a given, right? Go here, sell this. Let's go back. Let's go in. Sell this one too. <laughs> you thought I'm not gonna be using the new mechanics? You thought wrong. You thought wrong. <laughs> I'm so lucky that uh, we are we are an early adapter of this uh, this new system. Let's block. Let's go. But I do want to get our brass knuckles. Well, for now, I'm still missing a ring. Okay, we even found a token of energy. Wow. Just wow. I'm gonna take the token of energy and set up a token of energy run. But if you do this every time, stop doing that. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna stop doing that. If anything, the only way of this build powering up is actually energy. I don't see how this build can possibly power up any other way. Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna try to assassinate the backline here. What is happening? No... Yep, that's why the scratch button should be somewhere else. <laughs> Let's dodge. That's why the scratch button should be somewhere else. Ah, this guy's dead, obviously. Oh, we got a level. Nice. Let's go here, I would say. Actually, let's go here. So that we have more room for the shields. What is this? Sliding rune. Can slide left or right. Will push adjacent items. Can be rotated before it is placed. Can be used once per combat. Okay, so I'm not gonna take this. Now you might say, no, Sift, it's a new unique item, blah, blah, blah. No, this is uh, this is for the new character that they're about to put out in a week or in five days, or I don't know when, most likely when I'm going to come back from vacation. 
And um, I have already scoured in Discord and this doesn't do anything. It's like for the other character. I guess it's a leftover code that somehow gets pulled into the item pools. I, I, I don't know what exactly is working, but this does not do anything. Like if I put it in here, when you press it, it slides everything towards the life, left or the right. And whatever is off screen just, just disappears and you lose it forever. So the moment I put it here and then press it once, you're going to see everything slide. Actually, let me maybe showcase it as long as hopefully it can get removed. Please tell me it can get removed. Okay, it can get removed. But um, yeah, like you use it in the combat as 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 it's. Do you see this? Do you see here? Do you see this here? You, come on, where is? It? Do you see this? Do you see that? Here? Do you see the the spoiler for the new character? You see this? You see that? I'm not a mouse, but I'm like a bird or something. I'm spamming this so you can see it more often. So yeah, this 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 is that. It's uh it's buggy. It's buggy. And as you see, as you see, it doesn't even go into our inventory. We're not gonna handle that. We're gonna avoid the bugs if we can. Hopefully nothing, you know, completely crashed. Let's get a key though. Let's get a key. And uh, let's also get 12 damage, why not? I'm sorry for the delay there, uh, but I'm pretty sure a couple of people would like to know what happened, you know, and what that is. So I just try to clear out everything possible. That uh, might be important. 33 coinage, let's see what this is. Oh yes. Oh yes, oh useless. He's useless. Yeah, no, I can give this rage. <laughs> Never mind, no thanks. I'm disappointed, man. I'm disappointed. Could you not be the haste guy? If that guy was the haste guy, it would have been golden. I hate you. What are you? Different items, same rarity, also useless. All the useless things. All the useless events have gathered. Different items, same rarity. Are you kidding me right now? Are you kidding me right now? That guy is... Are you kidding me? Uh, I don't want to really sell anything. Not really. Okay, let's go. The fact that we got a blacksmith, which is insane, but we got the bad blacksmith... For this specific run, the brass knuckles run. Uh, let's also transition this over here. Yeah. Uh, by the way, I can. Yeah, I can have this already. Yep, I have this already active. If anything, this can even go there. Yep, this is active. Nice. This is active. The moment I use my energy, I, I get that ready. Ah, uh, nice. I like it. Executioner. On take damage spikes. Ooh, that's bad. Shield. Scratch. Okay, at least scratch. Okay, it seems like I take two damage. Like, I, I, I get damaged twice through my own spikes. But it seems like the opponent doesn't get hit twice. Some weird interaction is happening. I'm gonna regen up here. I didn't realize that, uh, you know... I saw the healing there. I see the energy too. I don't care about those. Okay, and we got him. Ring, ring. Okay, we got another one. Okay, you can go here. You can go here. Nice and dandy. Everything's nice. We got faster damage, which is useless for us. Uh, we got a key, which we might pick up. Might as well, you know. And um, might as well pick up this thing. It's rare. At the end of the day, we can just sell it. Let's go key throw away. Let's go to the new shop. Sell this thing. Boom. Now, okay, now that you sell them something, they destroy it, though. Conductive warrior up, everything's pretty much the same. Let's go on. Uh, actually, not there. Just checking the shop, you know, so that we know what is this. Cactus. On take damage, adds one spike to self. This was an item that was only in the side area of Act 2. So you could only find it if you, in the Act 1 final boss, you had a key and went to the other area. But now they just put it into the main game. In my opinion, very good choice. Uh, there is no real reason for having items... Uh, only in specific areas. I mean, there is, like, you can fabricate reasons, but practically speaking, there is no real reason other than, oh, uh, we want the items to only be accessible there. I'm gonna get the legendary to go and sell it, obviously. And uh, this is uh, this is more block than this, right? This is plus one for each one. This is plus... Wait, what? This item gets plus zero block. For each space to the right, this arrow this gets plus zero. And now it says it has four. How much does this have? Well, this has six, so we're gonna get the six shield. We could also go for this. You know what? This is a consumable. So, what can I do here? I'm thinking how to put this in. Honestly, I think I just pull everything up. Pull everything up, then get room below, and then the mask can be here. And because this is heavy and there is like no other choice. Now let's do that. Pop, pop, pop. Not really that hard to pull everything up. Every now, Other than this, obviously. Uh, this can go away. Up, up. Up. Um, there is room here for this, for example. 
There is room here for this, and then there is also room here for this. And this goes back. Nice. And pretty much everything is the same. Like, nothing changed at all. Uh, yeah, literally everything is the same. I still, if I use these actives, I still have the token back. Like, everything is literally the same. Is this used at least once? Three uses. Yep, this is used at least once. Let's go with the triple energy, which is like, uh, on average, six. Do I want to sell something? Wasn't there something I wanted to sell for one moment? Yeah, the, the, the little, this little thing. Here you go. Boom. Look how rich we are, man. Look how rich we have become. Let's go badger, 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 fight. 31. So much more defense. Uh, these guys do 29 damage. Boop, boop, boop. Fast. Hop, hop. We got regen. Nice. Once again, uh, we shield first. Then we go boop, boop, boop. And our next turn, they're going to be both toast. Because I do like 20 damage. I got my full uh, slew of rings. 20 damage. Uh, not only 20, but also the AoE Scratch. I really love the AoE Scratch. Uh, now, I'm thinking about putting Pavis in. Uh, another shield in, that means. What is this? Yeah, this is the conductive thing. I haven't found a better ring yet. I'm thinking about throw this away, for example. And then go something like this goes here. This goes here. And this goes here. You know, and then also one shield here. In general, I will push this into this corner and then to the one next to it. Like, I'm gonna have this here, at the very end of the line. If it doesn't allow me to go here, then I will start building this up and push everything towards the left, so that this stays, like, in the very corner alone. Although, maybe I should push it... Yeah, I can also put it, like, in this side. One here and then one there. Although it's gonna make these worse. Well, with the same logic, I can also put it up here, within two levels. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna slide this up, and in two levels, it's gonna sit just up there. Uh, yeah, in the meantime, though... <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm gonna increase my defense, and I don't really care about energy regen anyway. Like, if I have insane defense, it doesn't really matter. Okay, you know what, just use this. Shield once. Look at this, 3d8 shielding right away. That was the plan, literally. That, that was literally the reason why I did this. Uh, and also, I should switch these two, so that this provides armor. Because right now, it doesn't provide armor, but it is an armor, so this is gonna make it so that it's gonna provide block. When I say armor, I mean block. So, uh, how much damage is incoming? It doesn't really matter, because with... This damage, I can kill at least one, and then the rest are not gonna do enough damage. I could go shield again. Let's go here. One, two, come on, two, dead. Three. Could not have killed this. Actually, I could have killed. Yeah, I could have killed both. It's okay, though. Safety first. Okay, we got another shield. Well, um, spacing. Let's go here, let's go here, and let's go here. And also, we should switch these, so now this buffs this. Very nice. I'm obviously not getting the armor no matter what, but every time I press the Pavisa, I'm obviously full life. And I found a little Bakla. Okay, little Bakla is definitely something we want to use. So I would say let's throw away this shield specifically. And let's use the little Bakla. The more little Baklas we get, the better. I can have everything in one specific spot. I don't need to have everything spread out. Uh, am I missing something? Not really. I'm not really missing something. Let's go. Over here first. Uh, buy a book? Definitely not. Well, let's go over here to see if we find a legendary. Maybe another Brass Knuckle. No, we didn't get another brass knuckle, but we found the right gloves, so might as well put them here. You know, nothing nothing to lose. Right now, the token of energy isn't even doing anything. I'm still keeping it for a bit later. Once again, it's really important to get the key to the... Um, yeah, energy, energy. Energy is the only thing I need. Like, I, I cannot really scale damage other than, you know, duct tapes and more brass knuckles, etc. So, the only thing I can actually use that's easy to, you know, scale is energy. So, I need to try to get as much energy as possible. Obviously, a crimson ring would be better. <laughs> Obviously, but I didn't get a Crimson Ring. I, I I think I could have even activated the Crimson Ring if I want. Wow, legendary hat. Nice. Let's go with shield like a million. Yep, 47. Uh, we're gonna just strike the boss. I don't find any real reason to attack anything else. Is that actually true? I don't think that's true. Not the thing about this. Maybe I should start attacking every, some other things. Is that actually true either? This guy's dead. Continue with the boss. So I'm doing 60 damage per turn, as long as I press the shield. Yeah, I think I got the boss. Yeah, and one turn I could blast him for 60 anyway. Okay, shield everything. 47, that is... Uh, these two are 29, and plus 21 is 40, so... Now is a good chance. And next turn we're gonna blast the boss, and that's that. And my math was wrong. Where did I go wrong on the math? I don't know. It doesn't really matter either. Let's shield for safety, and let's go. I mean, it was 50 most likely, that's where I was wrong, because I was literally missing 3 life. Okay, all of these are useless, obviously. 
Uh, I could go with energy. By the way, I like the new energy. Uh, I could go with energy uh, just to have like the shield. Because this, for example, provides 4 block, right? So I could do this, and then this is pretty much 8 block. Uh, while obviously this is like 4 block, but everything turned for free. That's why. And I also want to change that ring, man. I want the lucky ring. Another lucky ring, or max life ring, or pretty much anything other than that. Snatch shield for 8 block against um, night shield for 7 plus 1. I mean, night shield for 7 plus 1 is better, obviously. Let's come onwards. I'm not sure if I want to actually keep the gloves. If I remove the gloves, I can easily gain energy, but also the free defense we gain is good. Is this build good? Is this build good? Uh, let's shield once. I have no healing whatsoever, by the way. Uh, let's scratch, scratch. And I would say scratch the other one. Come on. Okay, now this guy's gonna die from three hits next turn. Yeah, we lose eight. Let's go here, and now we go here. One, two, three. The scratch is not really pressable. Sometimes it straight up doesn't press it. Honestly, 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 if this build somehow... If this build beats the final boss, then it doesn't matter if it can do an infinite or not. Like, this build is already not really that strong. We haven't found anything that important for this build to work, you know. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do the same thing. So we're gonna go here, scratch, scratch, and then the last scratch to the other one. Because this now has 59, and I'm doing 40, 60 damage, lose line. Okay, and then we're gonna go shield again, and we're gonna go scratch, scratch, scratch. This guy's not gonna do anything to us. Exactly. Scratch, scratch, scratch. Bye. Come on. Yes. Okay, I would say we go here. I would say we go here. Uh, and push this ring in there. That's my opinion. Push that ring in there. Or, mm, I mean, the other choice would be to go here. No, no, no. We're gonna just go in there. And it's gonna be just a two-slot item pretty much. Right now it's gonna be a three-slot item. But later it's gonna be a two-slot item. And uh, I would say we go these two. So that I can push everything one spot to the right. Yeah, so I can have all these rings to this area, and then the shields in that area, and in general just change everything a bit around. So now you go here, okay, you go up here, uh, you can go down here for a moment, and uh, you can also go away for a moment, and let's go, we go hop. First of all, this, this has a problem, but it doesn't matter, hop, 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 just, just move everything other than those left gloves, lefty gloves. Okay, obviously this thing is not no longer buffing these. Uh, two block here. Three block here. Okay, these things are not worth it. Like, for two block, keeping an item, not really that good. For five block, yeah, okay. For five block, yeah, but otherwise, no. Uh, yeah, let's go here. This can float. And now I got my more energy. Yay. Yay. <laughs> Uh, what should I go for? I don't think I need anything. I can buy this. I can get this rare bow and just go and use it on the shop. There is no shop around. Okay, I'm not gonna take it. It's not like we have any money issues. This is four block. This is also block. Yeah, we gain a bit of block here and there. Let's go. I forget to use that thing. I forget to use the helmet. And now, what is it? What, what, what's happening? What's happening? Fire gecko, fire gecko, fire gecko. Like, are you serious? Why, why is this happening? Why is this happening? Okay, now I obviously get more energy. So, uh, and also have room for a curse. Because these guys don't really apply that dangerous curses. The main problem with the curses is that you lose room in your inventory. Did I literally throw away one energy? Like, did I literally just get an energy and then never use it? Well, it doesn't matter now. <laughs> or it does it. Two, three, shield. Go. It doesn't matter because obviously... Um, you know, opponent's dead. Why? Regen. At long last. Spell damage, obviously useless. We don't need spell at all. This has to become a slash shield. You know what? Actually, here, let's do the switch. Now this buffs this at least, while this was not buffing anything anyway. Uh, do I need anything else from here? I don't think so. Is there a shop? I don't think so. I think we can go. Come on, give me a good event. Nice. No! Imagine if both of the blacksmiths were haste, man. Imagine if both of the blacksmiths were haste. Just imagine. Let's go regen. This is gonna be a fight that's gonna last. Let's go here. Scratch one, two, three, and uh, four. Wait a minute. I, I could have killed one of the two up, uh, instantly. I was about to say Epiphthias. Let's go on. But what does Epiphthias mean, Sift? But what does Epiphthias mean? It means instantly. Let's go. Whoop, whoop. And here we go. I have started incorporate, a incorporating a bit of Greek here and there. Oh, I did not need to shield there. Please don't tell me to shield it twice. Nice. Spikes and healing. Healing for sure. And let's go. What was this? 
an unknown event it says but it shouldn't be an unknown event it should be a weapon blacksmith event here by the way a bunch of people requested me included that the blacksmith starts giving us you know a, a choice of what to upgrade just saying give us a ch oh we found a lucky ring i'm gonna take this for sure I'm gonna take the black ring too. I'm gonna go with good old, uh, use this. Reorganize, give me this, throw this away. Forget this ring, done the reorganization. Okay, I have one energy, I need to shield here. And I'm gonna take the curse, it doesn't matter what it is. Okay, continue with regen. Guys, there is no way you guys will regen faster than what I destroy you with. Uh, we shield once, and then we hope. You know what? These guys might be regening faster than what I get them. I'm trying, man. I'm trying. More regen. Let's go. Let's go. Give them the regen they deserve. I don't need to shield because the guy that has the damage thing is pretty much toast. And now one last curse, which I'm obviously gonna give him. How much regen do you want? Do you want a thousand? Do you want a million? Well, doesn't matter. You're toast. I want regen, though. I want regen. Let's go next fight. Mm, do we have a key? There is no key. Off we go. Off we go. I haven't found another scratch thing. I really, really... Come on, give me one more brass knuckles. If I get one more brass knuckles, then this build is a, a good build. Right now, it's not a good build. Right now, it's a normal build that is functioning. Right now, it's a functioning build. It's not something broken. It's not something busted. It's not something OP. It's just a functioning normal build. Okay, this is 25 damage incoming. Not really something to write home about. Uh, my DPS is not going to increase. I will continue shielding. Uh, but the thing is that the opponent's DPS is not going to increase anymore in a rate that is dangerous to us. You know what? Uh, I shielded already. Well, Once again, uh, it, it is very weird to me that there is literally um, a shield build in the game. And for some reason, uh, not a shield, a scratch build. And for some reason, the scratch is so not easily accessible. Uh, here, let's go with 12 damage. Why not? Living shadow, living shadow. <laughs> That's why not. Okay, 12 damage and let's scratch. Scratch, 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 scratch. Okay, at least one of the two is dead. The dangerous one. Okay, we're gonna go dodge the left one. Go scratch, scratch, scratch. Well, I guess we're gonna just use all the scratches. Now he's gonna go for the curse, which obviously is gonna hit us. Because I didn't do enough damage to him. Not that there was any choice. I'm gonna take 11, obviously. <laughs> we're not gonna take the worst curse in the game. Oh, I didn't see if they changed it though. No, I wanted to see if they changed that. And this thing does apply poison. I wanted to see if that thing now costs 3. Because I suggested them to make it cost 3, 5 block, another 5 block, and this is 2 block. Man, that 2 block is not worth it. Uh, I'm gonna lose life here. Is there healing? There's no healing. Uh, yeah, let's let's go life. Let's go lose life. It's okay. Just spam the scratch. I still have this anyway. Hop, 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 hop. And I, I don't even need to use this. Now this guy is obviously gonna, you know... Do its thing. Lose 11, 12. Oh, do they do this? No. I asked them for the big curse to become a three cost curse. That gets destroyed, but they didn't do it. What can you say? Let's go here and here. Both regen items. And the oak strong act. Now that they changed the, what the cost looks, you can see that this costs energy, which is green, and this costs gold, which is straight up golden. Uh, legendary, though. I could have sold it. Uh, let's go event. Come on, give me haste. Yes. Pavis, obviously. Yeah, because it's the one shield I'm definitely not gonna throw away and always gonna use when I get the chance. Yes, and it also triggers first, so it's by definition the best one. Okay, this fight is gonna last a while, so that region should pretty much bring us to full life. I mean, 4 plus 3 plus 2 plus 1 is um, I shield it twice. Whoopsie. Yeah, uh, 7 to 9, yeah, 10, 10 healing. So that region heals you for 10. That's very low. I have to say, very low. Can I get two more gloves? Please, give me two more gloves of knives. Please, game, please. Or one brass knuckle. One of these two. One brass knuckle. Again, or, 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 or two or three more gloves of knives. Two or three. <laughs> I increase the number very quickly. <laughs> okay, you go in the corner. And um, what should we open up? I can open up this side. Just pull these back. Yes. 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 Okay, right now I think the best spot is here. Actually, is it? This hits three. This hits five. 
Like, yeah, th this right now is 17 plus 7. This is 15 plus 11. Well, 17 plus 7 is 24. This is 26 right now. Uh, not sure if there is any possible way to make this better. Yeah, right now there is no possible way to make this. But in general, the plan is to have it like this, the way I'm showing right now, and then surround this one too. Obviously below, right? Obviously it's going to be somewhere else. And we're going to set the shield setup somewhere else out too. But uh, I'm really happy. Maybe this has to go down there. Actually, maybe this whole thing has to go down. And the shields have to go up. Like swip, swap these two things around. Yeah, something like that has to happen, honestly. Let, uh, let, let, let me do that a moment. Sift, stop switching everything around all the time. Mm, yes, I am going to continue switching everything around. You go here, you go here. Um, oh, that's not possible. Yeah, that's not possible because I don't have room be below the pavis. Wait, how is that possible? I guess because I have this little corner over here. Yeah, I'm missing this the same corner here. Because the pavis would be literally in this spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's because I'm missing a corner. Okay, on the next level, I'm going to fix it. On the next level, we're going to fix it. So for the delay boys and girls. Just, you know, testing things. Testing things. Shift, stop uh, apologizing every time you... <laughs> um, let's go with the uncommon and go sell it. Oh, this is heavy? The heavy blade is heavy. Okay. Water is wet, etc, etc. Let's uh, let's make sure nothing is off screen. Okay, all of these seem to be connected. Please don't. It feels so much that something is disconnected. Here you can take this. Okay, now this can go back to its place. And uh, is there anything left right now? Is everything connected? These are connected. This is more damage I forgot already. Uh, yeah, I think we're good. I can buy this. I have a lot of money. Let's go. Is there a key here? Yeah, I can also buy a key. Maybe we're finally gonna find another brass knuckle, man. Maybe we're gonna find another brass knuckle. And at the end of the day, whatever we find here, we can sell it back. Ah, look at this. We found a legendary, we found a ring. This was worth it. Uncommon and common. You know, it, it was worth it. Let's go to the shop. Okay. Let's say uh, over here, take a legendary. For how much? Here it's 17. Boom. Now we go away. Actually, we don't go away. What am I talking about? Yeah, perfect. Now this does even more damage. 13. And this does 15. Wait, what is better? 9 plus 17. This is 28. Yeah, that's 28. Actually, 26. While this is 13 plus 15. That is 28. Okay, 28 is more. So for now, we still keep this combo thing going. Let's go. I need one more ring. Two more rings. You know, a duct tape. <laughs> Classic case of the duct tape is broken. Okay, now obviously I do a lot more damage than I was doing previously. King. Okay, the king fight is most likely going to destroy us. Uh, shield. Let's see how much damage we do. 3d1 plus the 2 from this. Which doesn't add more spikes, by the way. Wait a minute. Did they make it so that every attack can only proc one thing? So that, uh, you know, arrow builds and cleaver builds and all those crazy things don't get completely countered by this? Maybe that's what they did. There is a chance that's what they did. There is an actual chance that that is what they did. And if it is, I'm all for it. I'm all for it. Okay, he's about someone. Scratch, 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 scratch. Yep, you're not going to do enough damage to us. We got the dodge still. Let's go shield. Now let's go energy to get rid of everybody. Right this moment, instant. I think this thing is making everything worse, by the way. Like, far worse. Against this boss, at least, you know. Am I blocking enough? Let's block enough. Uh, you know what? Let's block one more. Just to gain the haste. Just to gain the haste. Yeah, look at this. Now we have a bunch of haste. Boop. 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 And one more. Th nice. Okay, if I shield twice per turn, then obviously my haste is gonna be higher and higher all the time. One, two, dead. Three. And I have 124 shields, so it doesn't matter what you do anymore. Okay, now I'm, I'm, now I'm raising my haste. Yeah, it's over. It's over. As long as I'm raising my haste above what damage he does, we're super safe. Yeah, that's already enough. Uh, let's try to assassinate the moment. Bye. Bye. Okay. He's scaling. We are scaling. Everybody's scaling. One, two. Hop, hop, hop. Yep. 
I do get attacked twice. I do get attacked twice by the spikes, but I don't have to deal with um, him scaling quickly. So I guess you lose some, you win some, I would say. I mean, what what am I talking about? This is just positive. <laughs> you don't. We didn't lose anything. Like we were, like it, it, b before they changed this thing with the, how many debuffs the opponents gain. The the normal was that, you know, we get hit. We we buff him twice and we also get hit twice. But for now, it's at least he gets buffed once, but we get hit twice. So it's obviously better right now. Uh, I don't want to die. Shield. Safety first. I mean, next round we literally win. I don't care what item is going to give us. Like, the, the boss items don't even matter. Like, at all. Done. I could go for the shield spirit, but I don't have a single weapon. <laughs> so it doesn't matter. Uh, all consumables get plus three rage. I mean, this maybe, maybe. I mean, energy definitely not. I don't care about energy. Let's go. And this mode. I could get a spell, by the way. I could have gotten some kind of spell. With energy, I don't know. It would still take a lot of room. We win though, we won, we won. In case you didn't realize, we did actually win with this run. So it's a success story. It's success. And now we just need to find more rings. The more rings, the better. We found a huge mana stone. That's pretty rare. Uh, let's get the rare queen cleaver, that's also pretty rare. Is there a shop anywhere? No, but for now I can't keep the queen cleaver on us. Okay, another queen cleaver is incoming. Okay. That's a ring, but what does it do? Adds one rage to self on um, on energy use. Well, let's not risk the curse. That was a nothing happened event. Did they change anything on the Queen Cleaver? Nope, still the same thing. Still the same thing. Nice. I really enjoy that they buffed the fact that the opponents were gaining, like, uh, not buffed, nerfed, I guess. I really like that they made the game, like... Remove the opponents gaining a million spikes. Like I'm actually okay with it. I mean, think about this. You have this. The, you have the following problem, right? Everybody, a, a bunch of runs get killed because you know the enemies do too much damage against spikes. Now there are two solutions. Once, I mean, let's not go over analytical. I don't know why I'm trying to go the roundabout way. Let's just be simple about it. <laughs> Let me do my explanation simply for once. They just made it so that it's not obnoxious and extremely dangerous to fight. You know, a million opponents. Here we go. Uh, opponents that gain a million spikes. 15 plus 15 is 30. And uh, 17 plus 11 is... Wait. Wait, what? 17 plus 11 is 28. Okay, so this is still better. I guess the moment this becomes better is when I start putting rings here, here, and here. Right? Because right now this has access to, as you see, these much. Which is one... I mean, yeah, I don't even know why I was doing the addition. I just have to see how many rings get hit. Like, this way, uh, both of them hit 7. 7 plus 7 is 14 rings hit. While this way, this hits 8 and this hits 5. So, 8 plus 5 is uh, less than 14. It's 13, I think. So, uh, I, I'm trying to do quick maths while also, you know, explaining things at the same moment. And we found our sliding rune. Let's, let's do the same little bug where... Uh, actually, you know what? I'm not gonna risk this. <laughs> but if I press it here... Yeah, look at this. Look at... Do you see this? Do you see this? Do you see this? That's what you're here for, aren't you? Whoa! Did you see this in action, though? What did I throw away? What did I throw away? It was a shield for sure. <gasps> I bugged! I became the other character. I became the other character now. Can I push him back? Wow. Are they unbugged? Can I, can I like move and then uh, will they be unbugged? Okay, they're bugged. I need to reset this area. Please don't tell me I killed the whole run. <laughs> Please don't tell me I killed the whole run. Okay, first of all, we only lost the shield, but where am I? No, we didn't save after the boss. Dang it. No, no. Okay, I'm going to go back to that where we were. I mean, I can, I, I, I can ace the boss anyway. Give me a sec. I'm going to go back to the end list. Okay, I'm back. Um, well, first of all, there is a new bug now happening, which is that the items are floating literally in front of us. Uh, I, I, I have lost the lucky ring that we previously had because, we, you know, we got that after the boss fight. But I did find a little buckler. That's why I arrived here just to tell you that. So let's throw away the slat shield and put the buck little buckler in for a bit more room. And as you see, like, literally, I can... I, I, I will have this issue here forever. And I also picked up, like, a random spike helmet. 
so uh, yeah, let's continue the run at this point. I mean, I don't think they're uh, at this point. We are in an actual, you know, I guess side road. So might as well. Oh, I, I made a mistake. I killed them in the wrong order. So this is gonna leave now. We lost a bit of XP here, and we got this issue happening like every single round from here on out. Uh, is there a key? There's no key. Yep, there is no key. Let's go maybe event. Uh, the event seems to be the same, but it's not the same. Oh, by the way, they buffed it. Oh. First of all, this is when armor shields present. Okay, that's useless. They buffed this. They buffed this. Fires the first arrow in each row to the right, which is where it looks like all the arrows, and then fires the first arrow in each row to the left. Wait, what? Fires the first arrow in each row to the right. Fires the first arrow in each row to the left. Oh, it shoots six now! Ooh, ooh, that was not what it was. Normally it was shooting towards the right and above it. So it was hitting three on the right and one above it. Now it hits three to the right and three to the left. So now it shoots six arrows. Now it is unique. Yes. Yes, I, 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 by the way, my idea was to be three on the right and one and two top and bottom. Like, it would say, fires first arrow each row to the right, fires first arrow to each row uh, uh, on top, and then on below, something like that. And it would hit this, 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 and then the first one it finds that way in the first one. But now it is like one, two, three, five, six, seven, uh, four, five, six. So, yeah, it's it's unique. It's unique, I have to say. It's unique. I, I know I'm doing the same thing again and again, but uh, it doesn't matter. I don't want to pick up anything. So yeah, they actually changed that up. I have to say, bravo, bravo. Fully agree. I'm super happy about it. Good thing I started recording, by the way. Uh, let's go here and just, just throw these out. Scratch, 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 scratch. Can I get my lucky ring back? Like, can I get the ring or something? Can we stop giving me... Can, can you like... Oh, what is this? Is this like a poison? I can't even pick it up, man. I can't even pick this thing up. <laughs> That's so weird. Uh, do I gain haste? Yeah, I do gain haste. I had that previously. Uh, let's throw this away for 4 block. And let's put this in for 7 block. Yep, better. And I don't need health. I can get the energy. The floating weapon bugs? I don't know, man. Uh, I guess I only have to say one thing. You guys know what it's gonna be, right? If you know what I'm about to say, comment down below about it. <laughs> I knew it that you were gonna say... Did they test this? <laughs> how did it pass testing? How literally, how, how did it happen that nobody at all found out that, you know, the items get on top of your bag when you do a rerun, I guess. Can I, can I just press finish? Uh, first of all, first of all, let's do this. Th come on. This and this. And now I would like to go with finish choosing. Okay. Save the game. Game saved, nice. Okay, now we know for sure that nothing bad's gonna happen. You find a new shield, not that it's useful. Off to the shop we go. Ah, was the shop selling? Was the shop maybe selling the lucky ring? No. The shop is just selling this thing, the electric stone, which is also conductive, by the way. <laughs> uh, I could get a key to go and see what there is over there. Oh, let's do it, let's do it. You never know when a duct tape is behind the corner, man. You never know when a duct tape is behind the corner. Or maybe, you know, another brass knuckle. Or, or, or a ring. Or pretty much anything that I might want. Okay, nothing to see here. I really am happy that they made the Hawkeye bow so much better. I mean, theoretically, it's worse than the version I was suggesting. Because you cannot easily make the arrows look towards where you want them to. But no, that's actually a lie. You put the bow like here. And then you have the arrows to the left of it look towards the right. And to the right of it also look towards the right. And then you have all the arrows looking over this corner or something like that. I don't know. I don't know how you can min-max it. But uh, I I'm really glad that they changed it. Uh, I also don't know if I have some kind of way of picking it up on purpose. I don't think that's something easy to do. I like he's getting spiked. Let's go. Like it's not really easy to find a random legendary. I mean, even now I didn't find it. Uh, I mean, I saw it, but I didn't pick it up. I could have picked it up though. This time I could have picked it up. And this isn't even a flex. Like literally, wait a minute. You now can find the rapier wherever. No, the rapier is not the. Yeah, no, it's not the the, the weird thing. The rapier is the normal thing. Okay, we we dodge the curse there. You know, let's, let's avoid the curse. No reason to actually take any curse. Okay, that's it. Let's go. Nothing really to see over there shield in general with so much shielding we will be able to survive for a long while just so you guys know this is gonna be a seeming a semi a semi long run 
Uh, the semi being based on the fact that at some point we will die. Like, is it gonna be poison? Is it gonna be curses? Because at the end of the day, yes, we are immortal because of shielding, but we don't have damage to accompany that, right? Like, uh, yes, like yesterday, the run I was doing with the infinite spikes and infinite shields and infinite this and infinite that. Um, yeah, that was strong because I have all that. Wait a minute. I just realized something. Why don't I just go spikes? Like, I can just build up spikes. Now that I think about it even more, man, every time you go Pavis, you just can go spike build. Like, just the moment you find Pavis, you are like, okay, I guess I'm going to pick up the spike relic if I find it at a boss fight. Did I find another boss? Did I find the boss? Did I find the relic that has spikes in a boss fight and didn't pick it up? Did I make them? Did I do that mistake? Uh, he isn't really selling anything. Put it down a longbow. Let's go uh, fight a rabbit. Shield. Yeah, I mean we can go. Th we could have gone so much faster through all these by just going spikes. On the other hand, though, doesn't going a spikes build defeat the purpose of the you know the build we are actually going for? I think it. Uh, I think it makes it worse. Okay, we found another cursed item. <laughs> we find the cursed item again. Muscat Brigad. What is this? Okay, I don't care about you. <laughs> you not archery kid. Give him a weapon. I don't even have a weapon. Uh, you know what? There is no reason for me to farm. I mean, I can. I can if I want to. But do I want to? Ah, let's go. I don't know. Man, seriously now though. Did I actually miss a ring? Or what's happening? I mean, assuming my blindness is still intact, theoretically I should have missed somewhere a ring along the road, but I never saw it. I just want to min-max this build, man. I just want to min-max this build. I don't even want to become that much, more, that much more powerful. I just want to have my double brass knuckles and be like, yo, look at this, my scratches do 50 damage. But now they're doing only 31. I want my scratches to do 30 damage. Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, we... Organize, throw this out, get this in. Why is this gray? I'm getting afraid of, of bugs right now. <laughs> I'm starting to get afraid. Now oh, I got another lucky ring. I need five more lucky rings if possible. Can I get five more lucky rings? Okay, this is sellable for sure. It's a rare. Let's take it. Let's run to the shop. Shop owner, shop owner, look what I found. Look what I found. Okay, take it. Take it. <laughs> shop owner be like, but I don't want it. Was there a key? Was there a key in any of these fights? Who knows? I mean, viewers watching know for sure. Let's continue. Smacking. Uh, 13, 13. I mean, I will take one damage. Smack, smack. Go here. Smack. One more. Done. Now I don't take damage. I could have dodged, but... The main issue was the poison, not the damage itself. The main issue was the incoming uh, curse. When I say poison, I mean curse. Bye-bye. We found Vampirism. Completely useless. That's the bad thing with this build, though. The bad thing with the Scratch build is that it doesn't combo with a bunch of things. Because, yeah, because it's accessories that just trigger things. It's not actual weapons and actual damage. And this is a bad fight for us. Because this thing has 880 life. And these also curse. Okay, can I do anything? That thing is dead. Uh, we're gonna go with the dodge. We're gonna continue smacking. We will most likely die here. We will most likely die here. Okay, this thing has no... Should not curse us is what I'm trying to say. One. Nice. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of the smaller one. Okay, I was not able to. But it will die the next turn from AoE, so that's good. 16 poison damage. You know, this thing is really helping. Like, the Glove of Knives is really helping. If I just had two of them, though. If I just had two of them. Okay, we're gonna play the same way. Ah, oh, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead. It's over, it's over, it's over. We have lost, it's over. It is what it is, though. It is what it is. What can I say? Th this was predictable, right? This was very predictable that we would have died from poison. Uh, the damage was very low. Even with two brass knuckles, it was very low. Now, um, maybe I made a mistake somewhere along the way. I don't know. I mean, other than the fact that, you know, we broke the run. Uh, but before you go, don't leave, don't leave. I have new things to show you guys. The mo the de this, uh, this, it has more things. It has more things. Look at this. Look at this. Are you ready? Are you ready for something you're not ready for? Are you ready for it? Are you ready for it? Let's go start from Matthew. Boom! 
skin select. Did you realize that throughout the whole run I had a skin? Did you see it? Did you realize that I was skinned? That I had my my little uh, rook? Go back. Go back 20, like, five minutes below. Like, just go back three minutes and see. And realize that I actually have a skin. Like, be like, oh, wait a minute. He does actually have a skin. Wait a minute. I didn't realize that. Yeah, let's continue game. Look at this. Look at this. Did you realize that I am skinned? Huh? Huh? Look at this. Look at this little uh, necklace. Look at this little golden... Uh, what is this called? Uh, the belt. You know, look at this. And also, now, for anybody that didn't know already, the character is a girl. You know, it's Purse. It's Purse, a peppy rat from a poor village in Oakshire Forest. She aims to storm the dungeon, rebuild her village, and save her family. Yep, she's awesome. Yes, you didn't know. And now that we also have the image, we, you can also see the little bow tie over here. If you didn't already realize this thing here floating is the bow tie. It's very small and, uh, you know, you don't realize it. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys like the new patch. Comment down below what you like the most. Did you like the arrow the most? Did you like the brass knuckle? Or did you like the fact that we have skins now? Or did you like anything else? Like the new area. There was also a new area if you, do, if you forgot. So, yeah. I think that's going to be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for all the Patreon and the membership supporters. And if you also want to support me, the simplest way to do it is just drop a like. Simplest thing you can do that helps out the channel immensely. Did you see that little chicken wing? Go back two seconds or three. What is this? What is this? Guys, we're finding like weird stuff over here floating. What is this golden thing? Anyway, that is going to be it for today. Once again, thanks for watching and see you guys around.